Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for the Virgo Sun, Moon and Rising Sign. It is the last and final week of the year to, uh, for um, August, this is the year 2017. The week begins from the 28th of August until the 3rd of September. So, please listen um, to your um, monthly reading. It is all upload for the month of September. I want to say thank you to each and every person out there. Thank you for your like, share, and support. You're wonderful. It's going to be good for you, Virgos, in this year. Your um, your zodiac year, the year 2017, has just begun. It was. It didn't begin in uh, first of January. It is now beginning after your birthdays. So. Um, let's look at your, your week because your week is going to be, um, positive. Whatever the situation that is happening in your week is going to be positive. Um, the energy vibration is this week, the in week of intuition, you have the eye princess. This is wonderful. This is what I've been saying to you, Virgos, you Virgos or intuitive people. You work with the energy vibration of uh, the, the, um, the eye princesses and um, the energy vibration of your spirit guide. So you're a very intuitive person. So this week is going to be a powerful week for you Virgos out there. Whatever the situation that is around you, it's going to be extremely powerful. There's going to be a lot of conflicts around you. Okay. A lot of worries, worries and conflicts around you. Okay. Let's see what messages are going to come out. I'm seeing the eight and pen to the eight. Uh, the eight of sword is coming out you have the energy of the number nine number nine 99 it's the end of a period in your life the end of situation is coming there is going to be a lawsuit and whatever is going to be the end of a lawsuit whatever is happening with your work and let's see what is going on for you Virgos what is going on for you Virgos that uh, is going on for you Virgos in this week I see the energy of nine um, plane already I see the energy of eight so eight and nine is going to be happening okay all right on Monday you have the energy vibration of the nine of coins whatever the situation is of the nine of coins you have the energy vibration of the nine of coins so um, with the energy vibration of the nine of coins you have also the eight of coins so what is this saying is that you had money but you are still worrying about your financial situation okay so you had money you want to build on more money but some of you are worrying some of you are trying to build to receive more money some of you are just vibrating in the energy of money on Monday so whatever situation is you have money but you're tra you're doing as if you don't have the money don't do that because if somebody's helping you and you're lying about something this is going to fail you okay so on Monday you have the energy of the hurt it's your zodiac week and this is a positive week so for you Virgos do not lie about the money you have don't pretend as if you don't have the money when you do have it on Tuesday we have the energy of the king of swords whoever this king of sword is uh, um the skins of the, the whoever the king of sword is uh, there's a door that is going to be open okay whoever the king of sword is there is going to be a situation of uh, um clarity about the king of sword whoever the king of sword is there's going to be clarity about the king of sword information clarity about the king of sword is going to come this is as if some of you are having a relationship with someone who is an Aquarius a Gemini or a, a, a Gemini or a Libra and information is going to be coming out about this person as we go forward and we're looking at the crowning of your week you have the nine of swords the nine of swords in reverse whatever worries you have you no longer have that worry um, you have the energy vibration of the four of Pentacles you have whatever worries it was you no longer have this word and you are having um, a balance in your financial situation and that was what I was getting on Monday you have the nine of Pentacles but yet still the eight you were just carrying the energy vibration of the eight of Pentacles because you, you have money but you were saying that you didn't have money and that wasn't true okay as we move forward on Thursday we have the energy vibration of debt and transformation whatever that was happening 
um, the eight of ones, whatever that is happening, whatever that is ending, a lot of messages will be coming to you on Thursday. Whatever that is um, ending, a lot of messages will be coming into you. So you have no idea what was happening, but whatever that is ending, a lot of message will be coming to you to know and find out that whatever you had is going to be ending. On Friday, the energy of justice, a message of uh, um, a message is coming from justice to you. And this message can be good and it can be bad for the men. It depends for the women. It's going to be positive in some sort of a way. But for the men, it's great. It's not going to be one of the most positive thing. Whatever is happening, um, be aware, okay? Because... Um, some people are going to be winning some people are not going to be winning okay for the women it's going to be a positive for the men it's going to be a big win some of you on saturday we have the energy of the eight of swords um you're not having clarity but you are succeeding you are justified with whatever situation that is going with you're not seeing clarity here but you know um you are overcoming whatever has happened whatever you have done because it's something that you have done and you you're thinking oh my god i i'm not seeing clear i don't know what i've done okay whatever that you have done because you had the worries in reverse because you did something for money and now your conscience is bothering you whatever you did for money against someone your conscience is now bothering you and now I understand what was the energy of the nine of Pentacles that you have the money but still you are thinking that either you want more money or the you know I'm working towards because I need to have this money whatever that was happening you have done something against someone for money and it's it's you know it's gonna catch up on you whatever it's it is it's, you did um, it's not going to have whatever you did towards someone else the person is going to um, justify the person is going to um, win this victory because no you're not seeing clearly now you feel bad for whatever you have what you have done to that person Sunday we have the energy vibration for the M the the emperor and the energy of the emperor you have to to deal with the seven of cups so um whatever is happening you have uh, it's like you throw somebody under the bus and uh, uh, in your career and doors of opportunities are going to open for you but it's only because you throw someone under the bus um, if you didn't do this they wouldn't have seen you and they would have uh, wouldn't have given you this um, opportunity so again you know I say to people be aware of what you do because there's a karmatic situation because as soon as you do something they're going to throw you back underneath the bus and this time they're going to kick you out okay so whatever you have been doing at your workplace be aware of what you're doing because now they are being nice to you but the next time they're going to finally kick you out finally okay so whoever you are out there I'm getting this message be aware do not throw anyone under the bus at your workplace you have already done it you have done something um, because you you got money on Monday for something that you have done and you're seeing this playing out you know and this is so weird this is so funny but um, it's, it's it's a karmatic thing and you know something and people who you help are people who help you and you have done something and throw them on the because you did this because you want fame and happiness but the people are looking at you and think we're just waiting for you to mess up because we're gonna get rid of you so be aware because that is what is playing at your work and playing around you in certain things we're looking at the message of abundance to see what is coming in for you and the message is um, face your financial fears face your financial fears face your financial fears whatever the situation is face your financial fears because you are fearing about not having the money but you do have the money when you are honest with yourself about the fear of success or failure they can no longer control you be fair uh, be fair um, 
be free of hiding fears by exposing them to the right way and the awareness and you will realize that you in fact have nothing to fear and that every successful person has struggle and release these self-doubts here we go ladies and gentlemen please listen to the month of September reading I'm wishing you a wonderful week namaste